wants to find me I'll be in the last place you would look In a place where people used to be A land that's called reality You'll find me there How we feeling this morning, my lad? Confident, confident <laughs> What do you think of the team? Yeah, the team is decent today uh, Coxie has dropped himself, makes it even more decent, I think. Okay, <laughs> don't put that on camera. <laughs> don't put that on camera. So, uh, who's turned up, Coxie? Everybody apart from Delroy and Dan Huppen at the moment. So, because of that, Delroy and Dan Huppen have been dropped to the bench. They were both starting, um, but they're not here. I did make a point this week of saying in the when I sent out the information that if you weren't going to be here at 9.40 you were liable to be dropped which is sadly what's happened to the pair of them um, but what it will mean is we have an attacking bench if they turn up and um, if they don't turn up then I'll probably have to put myself on the bench which I didn't want to do Why didn't you want to do that? It's carrying a bit of a knock What number you got on Axe? Uh, it's 10 o'clock and there's 11 people out on the pitch, I can't believe it Nobody wanted to listen to us in Dorma. They're just your size, they're not they're, they're minuscule. They're not like 14 year old kids. Yeah, but they're, they're just your size. Yeah, every, everyone, yeah. I think the ball's fine. Everyone's bigger than me. What is that, man? It went in the thistles. That's right, isn't it? Yes, sir, I turn up there. Some prodigy or some shit like that. I hate the camera. Go on. No, I'm Put trying. You do it, you do it. Just play it. You play I don't it. think you've ever been on camera once, Shay. You play This it. is your moment. This is your moment. Come on, Lee. Show everybody who you are. I don't want to show who I am. <laughs> hey, you do it. What are we doing? Just to hear the music. And give the speech and all. How'd you play it? Press play, <laughs> and I'll hold it. original team had the two, two of the people that are on the bench starting but they're now on the bench so we're going to start with uh, Rob Lamar in goal making his uh, competitive debut for reality FC <coughs> it means that Delroy, Dan and Lex are on the bench and we've got Kevin as well and Chris Ward so there is five people on the bench but obviously not all five people are going to get on their energy Lee if you can try and stay on the last man We've only been caught offside once in seven games so far this season. It means we're not getting close enough to their centre back. So, oh, I've got great movement. No, no, we're not getting close <laughs> enough to their centre back. Stay on, stay on, the, stay on the last man and look, look for Rossi Groves. They'll be putting the ball through. Milad and Mick James, if you push forward, support Lee. Um, but just try and listen. I know it sounds stupid, but if we're getting called offside, we're obviously in the right positions because we're on their centre backs. We're looking to get in behind. Um, Welcome to you. On this Sunday morning, as Reality FC take on AFC Heathrow, there's changes to the starting eleven this week as Rob Lamar, James Ross make their full debut, along with Howard Rowland, who also comes in. James Mitchell plays after impressing last week, plays on the left wing. And obviously a few changes forced by the manager with players turning up late this week. There's Mike Shinoda. To Adam Groves, who makes his return after a, a few weeks out. It's a free kick to AFC Heathrow, who play in red. We have AFC back to their familiar blue. James Mitchell to James, sorry, to Adam Groves. Plays a ball down from the lad Mugadam, who goes past the fullback well. Puts the ball across and it's tucked out for a corner. By the goalkeeper for AFC Heathrow. There's Rob Lamar. With a good punt up the pitch. All the way through to Lee McDonough who finds himself through on goal and turns back. Tees up a shot and it's to James Mitchell who drills it in and the goalkeeper holds on to that. 
Rob Lamar again with a another punt up the pitch. Looks like route one for reality could be the order of the day as Lee McDonald plays it in. Only as far as the captain for FC Heathrow. Chris Drown with the challenge, but it's a through ball for number three. Goes through here, can he beat Lamar? And he chips in, and it's over the bar. And that's an early scare for Reality FC. Now it's AFC Heathrow who go Route 1. They won't get past Howard Rowland, making his debut at centre back alongside John Thing. There's James Mitchell. Looks to bring the ball forward. Runs down the wing well. Puts a lovely ball across. And there's Mogadan over the bar. And you may have seen Anthony Cox there on the sidelines as AFC Heathrow said the quick corner, he draws it across, his shot comes in, good save from Rob Lamar. And the second shot cleared away by John Finn. And Adam Groves with the header. As Lee McDonald holds up play. Cuts inside, can't find the pass. Mogadam can. But James Mitchell looks to go through and the goalkeeper comes out and clears that away for a throw. John Finn with the throw. Lee McDonald to James Mitchell. Nice ball into Mogadam again. He goes through and he couldn't get the shot away. And Anthony Cox holds his head in his hands as he blocks our camera view. And Lee McDonald wins the ball back. Mogadam to Groves. Can't find the pass. He's AFC Heathrow look to build something here but it's run back by Groves and he couldn't get his feet in position for a shot and it's a good strong challenge from Giran but the winger still brings the ball forward and he puts it in behind here can Alex Chistara make it a great save Rob Lamar and well cleared by John Finn this game really is very open at the moment. Chances both ends. Says he he throw looked to build an attack and good change from Chistaro. Playing the holding role today. There's James Ross. Takes his time on the ball. Into Chris Duran. Into Mogadan. Can Mogadan get in behind? Oh, good ball from Ross and Mogadan using his speed well. And he's brought down. Appeals for a penalty. The referee. Allows play to continue. Mogadam, not impressed. They've, they've got nothing. What are you saying? Look, 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 look. <laughs> no, number four. Number four was crying when our number seven did like a normal tackle. Yeah. But then it was a throw here for Reality FC, which Duran takes. And it on by Mogadam. Lee McDonald turns, scores. That's the goal for Reality they needed. As they go one nil up. It was a good turn from Lee McDonald. A little bit scrappy in the box, but it was a good finish from him. <laughs> Here come FC Heathrow. Trying to get back into this. Mitchell wins it back. Nice <laughs> from him. Oh, nice. Another bit of skill from him. And Lee McDonald comes inside. And it's a crunching challenge. Keeps possession. James Ross. Plays it back to Shinoda. That's awesome, mate. Up to James Mitchell. Get there, Lee. Finds Lee McDonald. The ball goes out. For a throw. How's the pass over, mate? Mikey, get a foot on it, how oh, it goes! Oh, Heathrow getting in behind Shinoda, the ball across! And John Finn, oh, calmly, and assuredly plays the ball out to James Mitchell. Keeps it in, but the number four wins it back. And Mitchell clears it away this time to Groves with the header. James Mitchell down this left wing. Little back heel from Lee McDonald. And a strong challenge from the number two. And the goalkeeper's coming all the way out. Panicking and sees the ball into possession. But there's Lee McDonald looks up and he can't get the ball in. And that goalkeeper now with the kick. Good header from James Ross. Adam Groves brings the ball down well to Mogadam. Who just goes past the fullback like he's not there. And he's into the area. Can he pick a pass? He can't. James Ross with the shot. Lee McDonald! Oh! That's a good opportunity for reality. And then now it's AFC Heathrow with the counter attack and it's cleared by John Finn. Sibby of the starting. Lee, 10, Ross, Millard, number 8, you've got. Come down here! Goalie, 7. The number 10 is through here. 
the Come ball on, Mike, rolls out. Come on, corner. It's Alzheimer's ball. Anthony Cox is laughing. I'm not sure why. The ball comes in. Number 11 picks it up, skips past Duran, puts a little ball in, and he's gone in. And that's the equaliser. It escaped Rob Lamar and that was the corner wasn't really dealt with. And that's the equaliser for AFC Heathrow and it come reality looking to get something more from the game before half time. Shinoda to Groves. Back with AFC Heathrow. Number three, good challenge from Chistaro. Groves goes to ground. And the referee oh, blows oh, for one of those two fouls, not Mike, sure which one. Jason, Mikey. Finn very comfortably brings the ball down, but the number three goes through here. Duran with pressure. Time to pick out his shot. Good save from Le Rob Lamar. The ball goes out for a corner. We have to see FC under pressure at the moment. Duran with the clearance. Chase Stanley! Chase Stanley! You're and completely cleared by James Ross. For number four. For FC Heathrow. Good pressure from Lee McDonald. Ball brought forward. Mogadam wins it back. Plays it into Adam Groves. Who picks out Lee McDonald? Who goes through here? It's a good save from the keeper. Lee McDonald giving the goalkeeper the eyes and trying to send him the wrong way, but he didn't. Header from AFC Heathrow. James Mitchell with the shot looping over the bar. I think that was a good save from the keeper. 16, throws it in. And the pressure by Howard Rowland. He didn't even laugh after. Not free. Turns well, but there's Shino with the clearance. And Groves can't win it back, and James Ross can. He brings the ball out, puts Mogadam for a game here. But the defender's catching him, Mogadam with a shot, it's a good save. And well held from AFC goalkeeper. And that's half time. So let's just someone hit him hard early in the second half. <laughs> <laughs> um, I made one change at half time, it's not a good performance just because I don't think we need to pay five minutes for uh, Alex if you go off, Dan Hubble if you come on as well up front. So we'll go 4-4-2, four, four, I don't think we need to have five in midfield, I think we we'll are get more chances with an extra man up top, we look to keep the ball with better leaves up there by himself, not getting to do a lot. And then Delroy and Lex still to come on, and they will come on early, so work your socks off. And Vinny? Um, switch on from set pieces I mean it's not the hardest thing to have a look see who's not been marked and if you're not marking someone go and stand next to them yeah. don't give them any time at all as soon as we give them one or two yards of space yeah. that's when they look a lot better team and it looks like we're struggling it looks like we're off the pace so from that from that even from, from that first moment, from the first time they get the ball, everyone's got to press as a unit. And when we do that, they don't have any time with the ball. We're winning the ball back straight away, and they're out of position, and that's when we're finding the spaces. So Reality FC have gone to a 4-4-2. There's Anthony. Oh, John Finn's missed that. But he brings it back down. Good composure. Groves to James Ross. To Shinoda. So Anthony Cox has made the attacking substitution. Really wants the three points this week. And it's Dan Huppin, who's been away for a couple of weeks. One of the fans' favourites, often mentioned on YouTube, and quite a few people asking where he was the last couple of weeks. But he is now back on the pitch. And that's the ball through for Lee McDonald, who couldn't get his shot away. And there is Dan Huppin on the left of your screen. Yeah. Playing up front. Exactly is a goal score. Lee McDonald goes past 16. The goalkeeper makes a great save. Very fast off his line. And again, goes to ground. Lee McDonald puts the ball in. And 16 takes his time and clears the ball. There's James Mitchell. Can he, can he finish this? No, he's played a pass. There's Dan Huppin. He shoots on. Oh, defended James Ross into the goalkeeper's hands. A missed opportunity. For Reality FC. And it's Chris Duran, the defender, coming off for attacker. Delroy Brown as Anthony Cox really does show some positive tactical substitution here. Oh, Brown goes down! Appeals for the penalty, but the referee says no. Rob Lamar, good, good kick up the pitch. 
to Lee McDonald who looks to go past the defender again. He does, gets the ball across, oh, Dan Happy. Oh, oh he skied it up high into the trees. And it's another substitution by our manager Anthony Cox. Alexio Vieira comes on to make his debut for Lee McDonald. Um, Vieira goes to the right midfield. Right. John Finn with this free kick goes up, goes with a header and scores! 2 1! We at TFC take the lead again in this game. And the question is, can they hold on and see this game out for their first league win of the season? Every board will be up to Anthony Cox probably arranging a transfer deal there. And as Vieira wins the ball back, inside to John Finn who bursts forward from the back. Well out of position. Hold it, hold it. And John, James Ross plays it into John Finn who plays it back to James Ross. Can he get the shot away? He can't. And the ball goes out for a corner. Huh? Shinoda into Dan Huppin. Shinoda does well to win it back. So does Dan Huppin. Back to James Ross. Nice ball into Mitchell. Leaves it with the dummy to Delroy Brown. Plays it across. And Dan Huppin with the back heel. James Mitchell goes through the goes down. It was the slightest of touches on James Mitchell, and the referee awards the penalty as he crashes to the ground. And it's Adam Groves who steps up to take this penalty. Can he win the game for reality? And he buries it into the bottom corner. And that's 3 1 2 Reality FC. As surely now they've got the three points they desperately need. Ogadam goes down and Howard Rowland defends well. Plays it. Finn with a header. Back now in defence after his surging run earlier. Mogadam wins it back and James Ross brings the ball out. Lovely ball in behind for James Mitchell. Little push on in there. He didn't go to ground like he did for the penalty. There's Vieira. Nice ball across. Groves couldn't get it. And there's Milan Mogadam with the shot. Somewhere in the trees where Dan Huppin disturbed a nest earlier. Don't put that in there, that's mental. What was that, Milad? Guys, anyone give Adam a hand with the other net? Come on. You bet I'm not going to reach it. <laughs> yeah, uh, I can. You can jump. Now I'm, <laughs> now I'm tall enough to help with the net, yeah? Uh, so, Rob, what did you make of uh, today's performance? Uh, all in all, uh, from obviously the pre season games I've played and now this being the first competitive game, uh, there's a definite definite improvement uh, what with the team spirit, even though there's obviously been a few defeats. Uh, heads haven't gone down. Uh, it was nice to see people talking, actually a bit of movement going on in the pitch as well. Even when it wasn't going for us at times in the first half, uh, no heads went down and we still kept trying to play some nice football, which uh, is thoroughly enjoyable. Uh, obviously, I got to boss the defence around a little bit when they started listening. Worked a treat. <laughs> I mean, three, uh, probably flat as them, to be honest. We had a few chances. They kicked pulled off a few saves in the first half. And to go in at 1-1 at half-time was, was probably a bit of a disservice. Uh, I think we should and could have had a penalty given in the first half uh, to, to give us that lead. But, uh, you know, come out in the second half um, and put it to bed. Uh, what do you think the difference in the second half was? Oh, it's the only cliches I can get in here. Um, yeah, what do you think um, the difference did you, uh, was your heart in your mouth when you got that late pass back uh, and the striker put you on a bit of pressure? <laughs> we're going to see a Manoni today. It was, I, I, uh, you know what, I, I was... That was calm. I, I didn't have much to do in the second <laughs> half. I thought I've got to have a bit of fun for the camera. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and are we going to see you more regularly now? Obviously, your yes, first game ab back. Absolutely, definitely. Uh, no yeah. injuries. You know, I'll take my fingers up so they're all all right. Uh, ribs are fine. So I think uh, this is the start of a, of a beautiful partnership. Beautiful. Well, excellent. Cheers, Rob. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.